from Islamic Cooperation Youth Forum, Ms. Zerin, Ms. Mr. Yonus, uh, who are virtually connected, Mr. Liakota Lilaki, Director General, Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy, distinguished guests, learned judges, all competitors, representatives of print and electronic media, ladies and gentlemen, assalamu alaikum, and a very good afternoon to you all. First of all, I would like to pay my deepest gratitude and homage to the greatest Bengali of all times, our father of the nation, Bangabandhu Shak Mujibur Rahman, the icon of Yod, under whose undisputed visionary leadership we got our coveted independence. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a great honor and privilege for me to be here in this media briefing program of Dhaka YC Yod Capital 2021 Bangabandhu Yod Art Competition after inaugural ceremony and the Holy Quran recitation competition, this is the second international level event of Dhaka YC Youth Capital 2020, organized by Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy under supervision of Ministry of Cultural Affairs, Bangladesh. It is a great honor and recognition for Bangladesh as we own the coveted YC Youth Capital 2020 by probing our merit in matters related to innovation, sports, culture, and inclusively youth leadership. It makes a significant recognition for the dynamic and determined leadership of Honorable Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina and her spirited government in the youth sector. The ICYF Islamic Cooperation Youth Forum and YC affiliate made this declaration on 25th December 19. We were expected to launch the event sequence in April 2020, but the COVID-19 pushed us back and we have remodeled and relaunched ourselves on the web platform. Ladies and gentlemen, Bangladesh joined YC in 1974 under the prudential leadership of the father of the nation, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. And since then, it has been playing instrumental role in different activities of YC and promote the common interests of Muslim Ummah in different international fora. The YC Yod Capital 2020 is an important program for not only the YC and ICYF, but also for Bangladesh. It coincides with the birth centenary of the father of the nation, Bangabandhu Shak Mujibur Rahman. <coughs> the event is also significant to us in this year as we will be celebrating Golden Jubilee that is 50th anniversary of our independence. Ladies and gentlemen, artworks and paintings are the expression of the creator. The artist pours his or her heart out on, the, uh, out on the canvas. One can get a feeling while admiring an artwork what's the message behind those stroke colors and theme. Through a creation, an artist delivers a message. His or her thought process, uh, perspective, imagination, emotions, passion, that world around and many other things might be. Competitions are important to motivate young artists and help them to develop their creative skills by exposing them on the contemporary talent in the field. By observing the work of their peers, artists have the opportunity to analyze and evaluate their techniques and outcomes vis-a-vis -vis those of other artists. 
competition, competitions are important to motivate young artists and help them to develop their creative skills by exposing them to the contemporary talent in the field. By observing the work of their peers, artists have the opportunity to analyze and evaluate their techniques and outco outcomes vis-a-vis -vis those uh, of other artists. As I know, from this competition, the jury board will select, up, uh, select top 100 artworks for the virtual exhibitions, which will be hosted by Bangladesh Shilpokal Academy, Dhaka. The theme of this exhibition is parity and prosperity under the categories of visual forms of artworks classified as contemporary art, calligraphy, photography, and graphic design. With this competition and exhibition, I hope we could be able to showcase our yours works to all. Ladies and gentlemen, exhibitions act as the catalyst of art and ideas to the public. They represent a way of displaying and contextualizing art that make it relevant and accessible to contemporary audiences. The art exhibition, by its nature, holds a mirror up to society, reflecting its interests and concerns, while at the same time challenging its ideologies and uh, preconceptions, keeping art relevant to society and to diverse audience at any given point in history is one of the main goals of the art exhibition and uh, one of the reason it, it is to, so important. Art competition and exhibitions are good platform that connect artists, art lovers, judges, audiences, etc. The creator and his work cannot be able to reach to the mass if no art gallery arranges art exhibitions. Art exhibition opening provide many opportunities for young artists to meet and celebrate. Beyond that, they get to learn about ways to foster their artistic career. I would like to thank the Ministry of Cultural Affairs and the Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy for organizing this media briefing to mark an important event of YC Youth Capital Dhaka 2020. I wish with all my heart the utmost success of this competition. I would like to express thanks to YC and ICYF once again for selecting Dhaka as the YC Youth Capital and convey my gratitude towards the global leaders and dignitaries for their wholehearted support. I would also like to express my hope and confidence towards the youth representatives of the YC member states and rest of the world. I hope that they will certainly make this world a better place than what it is now. Let me appreciate to all of you for responding our call and appearing in this pandemic situation. I hope YC Youth Capital 2020 will be a very successful event with all of your support and cooperation. Let me take the opportunity to invite you to attend all the programs of, to celebrate the birth centenary of Bangabandhu Shak Buzibu Rahman and the rest of the programs of YC Youth Capital Dhaka 2020. The power of youth is the common strength for the whole world. The faces of young people are the faces of present and, un, and our future. No segment in the society can match with the power, idealism, enthusiasm, and courage of the young people. So let us get on board to define a better tomorrow together. Thank you very much. Thank you all. Joy Bangla, Joy Bangabandhu, may Bangladesh live forever. Thank you.
Thanks a lot, sir, for your thoughtful and motivative speech. Distinguished guests, this is really an immense pleasure for us that Dhaka OIC Youth Capital for 2020 was selected by the ICYF Executive Board with its capacity as the OIC Youth Capital Selection Committee on 25th December 2019 in Istanbul. The victory came after a concerted year-long effort by the Ministry of Youth and Sports and the Ministry of Foreign Affairs to project the strengths and opportunities that Bangladesh offers to the youth. Now, may I request to the special guest of the event, Dr. Fadila Grain, advisor to the President, Islamic Cooperation Youth Forum, for deliver her valuable speech. Dr. Fadila Grain, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, just to confirm, can you hear me, please? Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Distinguished guests, beloved ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of His Excellency, Mr. Taha Ayhan, the President of the Islamic Cooperation Youth Forum, who couldn't make it to this wonderful meeting for pressing uh, conditions, I convey the warm greetings to the special guest of this special, uh, special ceremony. To His Excellency, Mr. Zahid Ahsan Russell, Honorable State of Minister of Youth and Sports, to Her Excellency, Ms. Sabiha, Minister of Cultural Affairs, Excellency Akhtar Hussein, Secretary Ministry of Youth and Sports, his Excellency Khalid, uh, K.M. Khalid, MP, Honorable State Minister of Cultural Affairs, uh, Mr. Bedrul Arifin, Secretary Ministry of Cultural Affairs. Please excuse me if I missed someone. His Excellency Liakat Ali Laki, Director General of Bangladesh uh, Shilpakala Academy. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. It's my utmost pleasure to welcome you to our media briefing for the Bangabangu art competition held under Dhaka OIC Youth Capital. I am most delighted that you have joined us today. I would like to extend my warmest greetings to you once again, and I highly appreciate the tremendous efforts of Dhaka OIC Youth Capital team for making this wonderful event happen. DECA OIC Youth Capital is designed to provide various capacity building programs, contexts, digital gatherings, cultural workshops, and solution hub for youth and with youth. Alhamdulillah, despite the current tough condition caused by COVID-19, we continue to carry out all those programs as planned step by step. In our initiation of OIC Youth Capital, we have set the following objectives create a platform for youth to introduce and promote their culture and traditions, provide a space for youth to get to know each other and to strengthen their cooperation and solidarity, promote youth active participation through social, cultural, artistic and academic activities and contribute to their personal development. This very program unites hundreds of youth from all around the world and gives them the opportunity to show their skills and talents and abilities to excel. Here, I can proudly say that we are approaching our goal day by day. This program is dedicated to the father of the nation, Bangabandu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. In this regard, I would say that this valuable gathering is not the first and will not be the last dedicated even to the father of the nation, Rahimahullah. This is because he is the founder of the sovereign Bangladesh. And now we are very proud that we and our young people see him as a role model. Ladies and gentlemen, our uh, dear brothers and sisters, art is a creative way of communication, expression, joy, and making others better understand things around. 
art has always been around in a way of, or the other and was used to help humans develop and express their work and activities. Art also provides us with a range of perspectives, experiences, necessities and comforts. It's everywhere. It's not just in museums and galleries. Art fills the depth of the space and entertains admirers as it provides us inspiration, calmness, optimism. Art does not discriminate among people. Art used to achieve greater things in life. Art is a valuable tool for rediscovery, understanding, exploration, and interpretation of the reality. Research confirms that arts and cultural participation lead to a range of positive outcomes for children and young people, whether in terms of cognitive development or well-being. Art helps youth develop many positive capacities, talents, and skills, which such persistence, collaboration, creative thinking, problem solving, motivation, commitment, and many, among many others. When youth are given the opportunity to experiment, art, self-esteem, and individual and societal well-being can be further enhanced. It is therefore critical that we do everything possible to unleash the full creative and artistic potential of our beloved youth. It is because of this we have the pleasure, we have with pleasure included art project within the program of DACA OIC Youth Capital. Because this arts competition will provide our youth in the OIC region and beyond with a highly effective platform to help young artists share their artworks and talents with the greater arts community. This also will give the upcoming and emerging youth artists the opportunity to have their works reviewed and value, reviewed by valued and experienced judges while gaining access to future arts exhibition and art success. This program seeks to discover and showcase youth's hidden talents, encourage them to adopt innovative techniques to develop their ideas and motivate more young people across the globe to explore arts and culture, our arts and culture, the arts and culture of a beloved Bangladesh. I believe we will discover many talents artists. I am really already looking forward to seeing those magnificent works of our young people. As ICYF, we have always attached key importance to art. Here, I would like to mention a few examples only. Fine Art Festival at the first short story context in Shiraz in YC Youth Capital 2017, international program was designed to bring together young writers from the OIC, OIC geography, highlighted the necessity of writing and publishing short stories and supporting the production and publication of short stories on themes on peace and human respect. Human Faces of Al-Quds International Youth Photography Competition was held within the framework of Al-Quds al-Sharif, OIC Youth Capital 2018. It focused on Islamic and intercultural heritage of Al-Quds. This competition sought to report on and describe the actual reality, lives, uh, daily reality lives of Palestinian residents of Al-Quds, in addition to their difficulties and dilemmas and just injustices they continue to face in occupied Palestine. The photographers were to demonstrate their vision of Al-Quds al-Sharif and it's important in terms of Islamic heritage, intercultural and intercivilizational dialogue. The competition was held under the themes of Al-Quds al-Sharif, Cradle of Civilizations, Al-Quds al-Sharif, City and the Siege, and Human Faces of Al-Quds. In celebration of Doha as the OIC Youth Capital 2019, we have in, in partnership with the Ministry of Culture and Sports of the State of Qatar, Doha Film Institute and Qatar Cultural and Heritage Event Center organized the short films contest, visual arts, context, under the theme of youth is the power of the nation, in framework of Doha Youth Innovations Award. Through those programs and many others, we have highlighted hundreds of talented youth and help them to discover themselves as future artists who can make huge contributions to the betterments of our communities and societies. 
Excellencies, distinguished guests, beloved ladies and gentlemen. Before I conclude, I wish that we all enjoy working as always with the spirit of unity and harmony and to continue to work towards peace, cooperation, solidarity and common values. After all, we all stand together as one. We work together towards common vision and that will only make us stronger and stronger. I believe this program will be highly beneficial for our youth in the OIC region and beyond. With that, I will do, we will do our very best and do all our efforts to support and inspire our youth leave the future they deserve. While reiterating my profound thanks to all of you, I pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us all the success and the blessings in our programs and projects in the OIC uh, uh, youth capital, uh, Dhaka, the beautiful Dhaka. Thank you again for your great efforts. Thank you for listening. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. Thanks a lot, ma'am, for your valuable speech. Yes, we also believe in working together toward the success. Thank you very much, ma'am, again. Shamanitu Shudhi. Ibar Buktubu Pudan Kurben Achkir Unushtaner Bishesh Utiti Jonab Mohammed Jahid Ahasan Russell MP Manunio Proti Montri Jubo Okrira Montronaloi Amitake Buktubu Rakwa Jone Binito Onurut Janachi Donobad Bismillah Rahman Rahim Honorable Dr. Fadila Grime, advisor to the President of Islamic Corporation Youth Forum, ICYF. Mr. Mohammed Akhtar Hussein, Secretary Ministry of Youth and Sports. Ms. Sabiha Parveen, Additional Secretary, Ministry of Cultural Affairs. Honorable President, Mr. Liyakat Ali Laki, Director General, Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy. High officials of different ministries and organizations, journalists, and other delegates from ICYF, Excellencies, Youth Delegates, and all dignitaries. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh, and very good afternoon to you all. Ladies and gentlemen, at the beginning of my speech, I humbly remember the greatest Bengali of all time, the father of the nation, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, whose parent and visionary leadership enabled us to emerge on the world as today as an independent and sovereign country. In the month of independence, I also like to remember with profound respect all the freedom fighters who sacrificed their valuable lives for the country during our great liberation war. Dear guest, if we look at the rich history of Bangladesh, we said we see that the youth community has made glorious contribution in every movement, every achievement in our nation's history, every movement, including the language movement of 1952, the mass uprising in 1969, and the Great Liberation War of 1971, contain history of their great sacrifices. This year is very much important for us because we are celebrating the birth centenary of Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman the founding father of the nation, and Dhaka Wise Youth Capital 2020 International Program simultaneously. The name of Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman holds a paramount significance for Bangladesh, a charismatic leader, magnanimous statesman, and global leader. A human being of such magnitude is a rarity. His struggle for the emancipation of the peoples of Bangladesh is unprecedented in history and remains an inspiration for the whole world. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to the Honorable Prime Minister of the people, Government of the People's Republic of Bangladesh, the mother of humanity, Sheikh Hasina, who in her strong hands is leading Bangladesh towards become a developed country and a golden Bengal. She has set an extraordinary example before the world to give shelter more than one million helpless Rohingya people in Bangladesh. Excellencies, Dhaka Wise Youth Capital 2020 International Program has inaugurated on 
27th July 2020 with Resilient Youth Summit with participation of 400 youth from 75 countries across the world. This program is one of the mega events celebrating in birth centenary of Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. Initially, we planned to celebrate Dhaka YC Youth Capital with physical presence of all dignitaries from home and abroad. But due to COVID-19, all plans had been converted to virtual platform, but committing the celebrate this program with great festivity. Ladies and gentlemen, art is extraordinary expression of some creative persons. It is a diverse range of human activities involving the creation of visual, visitory, and performing artifacts, which express the creator's imaginations and conceptual ideas with special technical skills and emotional power. Excellencies, it is a great opportunity for the youth of Bangladesh to participate in Bongob Undhu Youth Art Competition of Dhaka YC Youth Capital 2020. Calligraphy is very popular in YC member states. In Bangladesh, with other artworks, calligraphy is also very popular. Bangladesh Shilpokal Academy every year organizes a number of events on artworks. Asian Art Binal is one of the most famous and regular events organized by Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy. Excellencies, Bangladesh is fourth Muslim majority country in the world and third in, in the YC. The present government is always keen to assist such artworks on the occasion of birth centenary of Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. Bangladesh Shilpokala Academy organizes a number, number of events on different branches of arts like artworks, festival, dramas, short film festival, etc. But Bangabundu Youth Art Competition is exceptional and it covers the whole world. All youth artists of Muslim Ummah in the world are eligible to apply. On behalf of Ministry of Youth and Sports, I would like to congratulate them and hope that the youth artists will put a milestone in the Muslim Ummah and the whole world will be able to know in new dimension. I hope this completion will be organized by the Shilpokal Academy every year. Excellencies, I am delighted to inform that the father of the nation, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, had established Bangladesh Shilpokal Academy. The objective of this academy is to improve the art of art and culture throughout the country. They can exchange culture of Bangladesh with other countries of the world. Through the cultural events, the world can know the harmony, peaceful and tranquil Bangladesh. Excellencies, we hope that this event will help us to achieve largely some of the targets of YC and ICY. We have about 53 million of youth resulting to demographic dividend, which can also act as driving force for the development of the YC member states. The youth are always capable for promoting cultures and traditions in an innovative way, strengthening the brotherly ties and promoting the spirit of unity. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to express thanks to YC and ICYF once again for selecting Dhaka as the YC Youth Capital 2020. I also convey my gratitude towards other delegates and excellence for their generosity. Finally, let me appreciate all of you for your awesome response in spite of COVID-19 situations. We hope YC Youth Capital 2020 program will be very successful once with all our support and cooperation from all of you. I hope to organize the closing ceremony of Dhaka YC Youth Capital program with physical presence of all award winners, high-level delegates of YC member states, including youth delegates and other distinguished guests. I'm waiting to wel welcome you all to celebrate that closing ceremony of YC Youth Capital 2020 International Program. At the end, I'm highly confident that the relationship between YC, ICY, and Bangladesh will be more fraternal and remain forever, inshallah. Long live Bangladesh, YC, ICY, ties. Thank you all. Joy Bangla, Joy Bangabundhu, may Bangladesh live forever. Thank you all.
Thank you very much, sir, for your informative speech. Ladies and gentlemen, as you know already, the theme of the art competition is parity and prosperity, that is, shamuta ibung shamridhi, under the categories of visual forms of various artworks. Ladies and gentlemen, now please enjoy the promo on the Youth Capital 2020-21 Bongubundhu Youth Art Competition. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, Mr. K. M. Khalid MP, Honorable State Minister, Minister of Cultural Affairs, and our Secretary, Minister of Cultural Affairs, Mr. Badrul Arifin, was supposed to be present in this press conference, but due to a very important meeting they could not join but we are happy that uh, honorable state minister for youth and sports mr jahid ahsan rasil mp honorable secretary minister of youth and sports mr akhtar hussain secretary bangladesh shilpakala academy Mr. Naushad Hussain and Director Fine Arts Department, Bangladesh Shilpakala Academy, Sayyidah Mahabubha Karim, 
honorable journalist honorable guest thank you very much very good afternoon for you all we are very very happy to host dhaka yc youth capital 2020 2021 bangabandhu youth art competition with the theme parity and prosperity which will be held from 15 to 30th april 2021 and the submission and uh, registration for joining this exhibition starts from today and it will continue 31st of march and artwork and regional award selection will be held 1st to 7th april 2021 and announcement of selected artist 8th to 10th april grand award selection process will be held 11th to 13th april and the exhibition will be virtually organized by bangladesh shilpakala academy from 15th to 30th april we are really very happy as you have already learned that bangladesh shilpakala academy the national academy of fine and performing arts have been established by the father of the nation bangabandhu sheikh mujibur rahman and we used to organize many national and international event bangladesh uh, is the land of art and culture and it has thousand years of traditions uh Asian Art Biennale, Dhaka Art Summit, International Film Festival, International Children Film Festival, International Drama Festival, and many more. We used to organize every year, and YC has been established in 1969, and. we are so happy that after the freedom after the liberation war immediately after we have joined with yc with the leadership of our father of the nation bangabandhu sheikh mujibur rahman this art event will play a very important role uh, we know that there are many discord we observe here and there in different part of the world the source of discord is also there it is true and alas that worry is never far from men's hearts but it is also true that despite of the dark forces that oppose them the means of safeguarding peace depends on man on man alone and upon each and every of them with the people of the art try with our work to make our planet at last to live on and that still means above all that we must create an art for a peaceful present and a friendly future in which man is a helpmate to man it is our time people's artistic tastes and requirement have grown immensely and have become more varied and we the artistic intelligentsia must do our utmost to satisfy men's thirst 
for knowledge and his aspirations for the beautiful. Shudhi Mandali, Bangladesh, Ashole Shilpe Desh, Shahite Desh, Amade Roche Hajar, Hajar Bachori Tihash with Tijo, Bangamundu Bolten, Jamade Shamosto Itihashe Mulji Bishoti, Shabarupore Manushoto, Taharupore Nai, Amade Porostuniti, Amade Dorson, Amade Razniti, Shopkichui, সেই মূল্যবোধের আবর্তিত আমরা মনে করি ওআইসি একটা গুরুত্বপূর্ণ ভূমিকা পালন করছেন তার জন্মলগ্ন থেকেই এবং আইসেসকো নামে আরেকটি অর্গানাইজেশন আছে সেই প্রতিষ্ঠানটিও এই যে ইসলামিক যে মূল্যবোধ ভালোবাসা সৌহার্দ্য আত্মিক সম্পর্ক এবং শান্তিময় একটা বিশ্ব সেই দর্শন যাতে শুধুমাত্র 57টি দেশ এই ওআইসি সঙ্গে যুক্ত তারা শুধু নয় সারা বিশ্বে ছড়িয়ে যায় সেই মূল্যবোধ নিয়ে কাজ করছে এবং আমরা তাদের সঙ্গে একাত্ম আমরা বাংলাদেশ শিল্পকলা একাডেমি জাতীয় পিতা প্রতিষ্ঠিত করেছিলেন শিল্পের সকল শাখার উৎকর্ষ সাধন সকলের জন্য শিল্প সংস্কৃতি এবং আন্তর্জাতিক বিশ্বে তা সুপ্রতিষ্ঠিত করা আজকে আনন্দের সাথে আমরা বলতে চাই আমরা ভাষা আন্দোলন করেছি এখন এটি আন্তর্জাতিক মাতৃভাষা দিবস এবং আন্তর্জাতিক মহল মনে করে যে বিশ্বের যে ভাষা যেগুলো প্রতি বছর 20 থেকে 25 টি ভাষা নাকা হারিয়ে যায় তা রক্ষা করার জন্য বাংলাদেশের কাছ থেকে অনুপ্রেরণা নিতে হবে তো সেই দেশ সেই ভূখণ্ডের হাজার মনীষীর দেশ যাদের দর্শন পৃথিবীর সভ্যতা মানবতা শান্তি বজায় রাখা আমি সেই ক্ষেত্রে আমাদের মানুষেরা আমাদের শিল্প সাহিত্য আমাদের দর্শন আমাদের রাজনীতি সেই লক্ষ্যে আবর্তিত আমরা মনে করি ওয়াইসি এর সকল কর্মকাণ্ড সফলভাবে সম্পন্ন হবে আমি অনেক অনেক কৃতজ্ঞতা জানাই যুব ক্রিয়া মন্ত্রণালয়কে সংস্কৃতি বিষয়ক মন্ত্রণালয়কে এবং পররাষ্ট্র মন্ত্রণালয় যারা সরাসরি আমাদের এই কার্যক্রম বাস্তবায়নে বিশেষ ভাবে সহযোগিতা করছেন এবং আজকের এই প্রেস কনফারেন্সে माननीय যুব ক্রিয়া প্রতিমন্ত্রী জাহিদ হাসান রাসেল এমপি মহোদয় এবং সচিব মহোদয় আক্তার হোসেন এবং আমাদের সঙ্গে যুক্ত হয়েছে ওয়াইসি পক্ষ থেকে ডক্টর ফাদিলা গ্রাইন অ্যাডভাইজার টু প্রেসিডেন্ট অফ ICYF, Ms. Fardila, we are very grateful to you and we have enjoyed your speech and we hope that uh, our event will be a successful one and we are optimistic that in future uh, we'll arrange, we'll do many events under the umbrella of YC. Shangbadik Bandhura. আপনারা নিশ্চয়ই যে ফোল্ডারটি পেয়ে যাবেন এবং আজকে থেকে এটাই ইন্টারন্যাশনালি আমাদের এই প্রমোশনটা শুরু হবে এই এক মাস সাবমিশন হবে রেজিস্ট্রেশন হবে এবং তারপরে যে শিডিউল গুলো সেটি যদি আপনাদের পত্রপত্রিকা মিডিয়াতে আপনারা যথাযথভাবে প্রচারিত হয় তাহলে আমরা বাংলাদেশের পক্ষ থেকে যে শিল্পীরা অংশগ্রহণ করবে তারা অবহিত হবে আমি আবারো আজকের অতিথি সাংবাদিক বন্ধুরা সামনে যারা ছিলেন তাদের সকলকে অনেক অনেক ধন্যবাদ জানি আমার কথা এখানে শেষ করছি জয় বাংলা জয় বঙ্গবন্ধু বাংলাদেশ চিরজীবী হোক সম্মানিত সুধি আমরা এতক্ষণ মূল্যবান বক্তব্য শুনলাম আজকের সংবাদ সম্মেলনের माननीय সভাপতি এবং বাংলাদেশ শিল্পকলা একাডেমির মহাপরিচালক শ্রদ্ধেয় জনাব লিয়াকত আলী লাকির Thanks a lot, sir, for your informative and motivative speech. Thank you very much, sir. Ibare Dhonobad Gapon Kurben, Soyoda Mahabuba Korim, Purichalo, Charukola Bibhak, Bangladesh Shilpakola Academy, Amitake Bini Tonuruts Janachi, Tarbuk Toborak Bajone, Dhonobad. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of Bangladesh Shilpakola Academy, it's my pleasure to thank our honorable. 
स्टेट मिनिस्टर मिस्टर जाहिद हुसैन एम पी जाहिद हुसैन रसल एम पी एंड सेक्रेटरि स्पोर्ट एंड यूथ एंड स्पोर्ट्स जनब अख्तर हुसैन एवं एंड अनबल रेसपेक्टेड डिरेक्टर जेनारे बांगलेश शिल्पकला अकाडेमी मिस्टर लियाकत अली लाखी एंड सविया परवीन एडिशनल सेक्रेटरि बांगलेश कलचार एफेयर्स एंड मिस्टर नौशाद हुसैन सेक्रेटरि बांगलेश शिल्पकला अकाडेमी अनफर्चुनेटलि आवर कलचार मिनिस्टर मिस्टर ए के एम खालिद बाबू इज एबसेंट टूडे बिकज अफ वन भेरि इम्पर्टेंट मीटिंग एंड आवर सेक्रेटरि हिज अल्सो इज भेरि बीजी उथ ए गवर्नमेंट प्रोग्राम बांगलेश आई एम अल्सो इज अल्सो उथ आस मिस्टर मिस Fadiza Gwine, Advisor President of ICYF. President Mr. Taha is unfortunately is not with us today. We are sorry for that. And also all YC member virtually with us, present with us today. And our member press member of press and electronic media person all assalamu alaikum i'm only a director of bangladesh shilpakala academy finance department by the way i'm also painter for that reason i can say something that i request to all i can i can understand that this is a young art exhibition all over the world young uh, artists can do very nice things nowadays because they can see the world in their hand because of this is a modern technique modern way to know they know very well i would request all to you support us for this art competition and virtual uh, exhibition because of can pandemic situation we cannot do it proper way natural way and normal way because you know worldwide this is a very bad position of covid because of covid so maybe in future we can do it properly alhamdulillah we can do it very nicely but this time we have to do it virtually thank you all please support with us all electronic media person and journalists thank you again thanks a lot ma'am for your valuable speech shamanito shudhi ebong shangbadik bondhura youth capital 2020 21 बंगबंधु यथ आर्ट कम्पिटन उपलक्षे आयोजित आजकल ये संबाद सम्मेलन एके बारे शेष पर्या चले आजकल ये संबाद सम्मेलन उपस्थित माननीय अतिथिवृंद उपस्थित सकल के असंख्य धन्यवाद जानिए आजकल ये आयोजन समाप्ति घोषणा कर सकल के असंख्य धन्यवाद